In this question, we're given the ratios of what Jennifer, Becky, and Susan contribute. The trick here is to come up with some fraction that we can multiply the $100,000 by in order to determine what each contributor gives. Let's add 2, 3, and 5 equals 10. So if Jennifer, Becky, and Susan collectively contributed $10, Jennifer would have contributed $2. Becky would have contributed $3, and Susan would have contributed $5. In other words, Jennifer contributes two-tenths of the amount, Becky contributes three-tenths of the amount, and Susan contributes five-tenths of the amount. Let's reduce our fractions to make life a little easier. So, Jennifer contributes a fifth of the total contribution, Becky contributes three-tenths, and Susan contributes half. Now we can multiply these fractions by the total $100,000 contribution to find precisely how much each of them contributes. Jennifer contributes one-fifth times $100,000 or $20,000. Becky contributes three-tenths times $100,000 or $30,000. And Susan contributes half times $100,000 or $50,000? So the answer to this question is $30,000. If Susan contributes $50,000 and Jennifer contributes $20,000, Susan contributes $30,000 more than Jennifer does.